warm greetings to the students teachers and honorary judges viewing this video today i pratish anand and my partner abhishar singh are going to demonstrate our exhibit cybernetic arms cybernetic arm commonly known as a robotic arm is a programmable mechanical arm with functions similar to a human arm these arms are multifunctional and can be designed for both everyday uses and specific activities some of the applications of the cybernetic arms are number 1 the arms can be used to decrease the need of human labor in factories by performing basic pick and place functions they can also be automated to work without the need of human supervision this reduces the overall processing cost of a product number 2 the arms can be combined with mobile bots for work in various hazardous conditions like fire ice nuclear contaminated zones etc number 3 the arm can be equipped with necessary sensors to perform delicate laboratory experiments which cannot be done by hand for example researches involving contagious bacteria and viruses number 4 the arm can be used to assist and aid people with disabilities with the progress towards tech like new learning the arm can be linked to disabled persons brain and made into a prosthetic at affordable cost components used the model has two major components servo motors and arduino uno the arduino uno is an open source microcontroller board the board is equipped with sets of digital and analog input slash output pins that may be interfaced to various expansion boards and other circuits servo motor a servo motor is a rotatory actuator or linear actuator that allows for precise control of angular or linear position velocity and acceleration it consists of a suitable motor coupled to a sensor of position feedback working first we use cardboard to form a base for a robot arm a servo motor is attached to the base to allow for basic rotation of the arm on the xy axis a stand is attached on the base to place the arm the arm is then fixed to the stand with the help of a servo motor to allow for rotation along the stand a grappling extension is now fixed to the arm Another servo motor is used to regulate the opening and closing of the grappling extension. The mechanical aspect of the model is done. Now the servo motor are connected to the Arduino Uno and coding is done as per the requirements. The arm is now ready to use.